Sunday. If you don't feel like it, if you do feel like it, you just got to until you do feel like it. Why? Uh, Les Brown said it best. He said, any day above ground is a good day. You don't believe it? Try making it what I want. <laughs> so uh, real quick. So TGIM times seven, what does it stand for? Thank God. It's a marvelous, manifesting, motivational, mindset, momentous, money making Monday. And so I'll give you a couple acronyms for Monday. And then, of course, my friend, uh, give you just a quick little powerful thought. And uh, you're going to love what I'm going to talk about today. I'm going to talk about breakthrough believers are achievers, receivers, and eventually succeeders. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> so real quick, let's get the, uh, let's give you the acronyms real quick. Uh, and that is mindset for Monday. Well, I'll just give you, let's give you the one. Uh, I got two different ones. So that, let's start with the first one. And that is moving um moving optimistically negates discouragement and yuckiness moving optimistically negates discouragement and yuckiness and so anyway so what i'm saying is this my friend so so on a monday you just gotta learn to move optimistically by the way the first word just move you gotta learn to move right so we gotta as a matter of fact as soon as i'm done with this i'm getting out there walking my friend and uh, again, just having that little yuckiness this morning, my own self, right? But that's okay. We're going to break through it. And so the th way we break through it is what? By moving. So you got to get your body engaged and moving, my friend. And so uh, anyway, I did some walking and praying earlier, but but now my friend going to get out there and get some fresh air and so forth and move. And so when you move, but not just move, move optimistically, right? When you move optimistically, by the way, sometimes, sometimes, the discouragement you're going through is you just have you're dehydrated. You haven't drank enough water. As a matter of fact, in my book, uh, where's that? Anyway, your breakthrough is guaranteed. On the one page, I talk about how some people call me they're a little depressed. You know, when I say just take three glasses of water consecutively, wait about 10, 15 minutes and call me back. Here's what happens. The brain is about 90% water and 80% of people are dehydrated. And the first thing what that happens in dehydration is the neurotransmitters clang together, my friend, and literally drops you down into a state of depression because the brain doesn't have enough fuel to function. And by the way, think about this. When you, you ever been up against a mirror and you ever exhaled? When you inhale, that's one thing. When you exhale, what happens when you're close to a mirror? Come on, what happens? You fog up the mirror. You know why you fog up the mirror? Because there's what? There's water, mist that's coming out. So here's the thing that people don't understand. Every time you inhale, you exhale. When you exhale, you're losing fluids. So what do you think happens when we're asleep all night? We're breathing in, we're breathing out, right? Guess what happens? So everybody wakes up dehydrated. That first thing I do, I have water right beside and just, you know, got to drink, right? So I do easily 32 ounces the first thing in the morning, my friend. <laughs> That's, you know, now I'm a little bit bigger, right? But but I'm saying, but but you got to rehydrate yourself, my friend. And then when you get your body moving, right, you get some action. Then you So anyway, so, so Monday stands for moving optimistically. So I need you to move, but I also need you to move optimistically, knowing that if you're doing this and when you move, I, don't, I mean move your body. When you move, I mean drink some water when you move. Ooh, I'm telling you, my friend, you can have a breakthrough Monday on purpose and by design. So, so moving optimistically negates discouragement and yuckiness. Come on, somebody. So, so, so as a matter of fact, I had a guy, uh, was it Saturday? You know, I had a person that was in the business and excited. And, uh, and man, I, you know, I met this guy and he got started with me in one of my businesses. So I was super excited. And I'm always excited when I can walk within my purpose and create profit while helping other people, right? And then, um, what was it, Saturday, was it? Was it Saturday? Anyway, yeah, well, the next day. So he's like, oh, man, uh, I think I moved too fast. So let me cancel that order. I'm like, cancel the order. <laughs> So like, hey, so I tried to give him a call. He didn't answer. So I was like, okay, whatever. So, hey, so I got a hold of him. So, okay, hey, yeah, they'll, they'll get you a refund. Don't worry about it. So then my friend, literally this morning, I'm in my prayer closet and I get a text and the text says, <laughs> I want to be part of this brilliant project at the level I had joined. This is one of those projects that doesn't come along every day. So it says, I hope you don't think badly of me. If you don't mind, please keep me in the ranks. Now, uh, the CEO was in this same text, and he says, well, hey, uh, called the guy's name out and said, well, we already canceled and refunded you. Would you like to restart again? And his answer was yes. <laughs>
Are you with me? So, so here's what I'm saying, my friend. So sometimes, sometimes the things that, that drain us a little bit, it's, it's not even the full reality. The full reality is this, my friend. So, so, so I was a little bummed out because I'm thinking, man, this guy was excited and, and, and man, I'm excited because I always love what I could help people. And then all of a sudden he's like, like buyer's remorse, right? That, that kicks in. People have that buyer's remorse, right? And, uh, but uh, anyway, so literally while I was praying, <laughs> The guy calls back and says, uh, sends a text, right? So what I'm saying is this, my friend. I'm saying, so you got to move optimistically. When you move optimistically, for again, acronym for Monday, move, moving optimistically negates discouragement and yuckiness. Uh, you're going to have some days, my friend, when you just wake up on top side. You're going to have some other days when you don't wake up on top side. And usually Monday is that day. So I've done this a couple Mondays, uh, and, and, and uh, I wasn't even going to do it this morning. I was like, wait a minute, I was supposed to do it once or twice, and then I think, Couple times, and I was like, "Well, I'm not really having the participation that I wanted." And so, I said, well, you know what? So, if I'm if I'm going to stop doing it, let me let me let me do it, and then then I'll stop. Like, but today I wasn't feeling like it, so I was like, "Well, I, I got to just do it to, to, because I'm supposed to just do it." And uh, if I announce this is the last day, then that's fine, you know, because don't have the participation. That's okay because here's what I'm understanding, my friend. You, oh, 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 oh my goodness! You got to write this down. You got to learn to give your listen. You got to learn to go give your energy and your talents, you got to go where you're appreciated and celebrated and not just tolerated. Oh, come on, somebody. Y'all didn't hear that one. <laughs> Matter of fact, let me, let me find, I, I wrote that down the other day. Let me, let me find the full quote and give you the full deal, my friend, because that was, I was like, whoa. So anyway, let me see if I can find it real quick. So is, is, so so get this now, go where you, now get this, go where you, your talents, and your energy is, first of all, appreciated, number two, celebrated, number three, reciprocated, instead of just tolerated. Oh, I, I got to say that again, man. This, this is what gave, this is another thing that gave Dr. Breakthrough a breakthrough, okay? <laughs> and remember, it's Dr. Breakthrough. I needed more breakthroughs than anybody that I know. And again, my whole life is committed to going from breakthrough to breakthrough, the bigger breakthrough, the bolder breakthrough, right? And in the midst of those breakthroughs, sometimes you have a breakdown, but that's okay, my friend, because it's like what like said, the people thought, like I said, they, <laughs> they thought they buried us, but they didn't know we were seeds and they just planted us and now we're growing back. Oh, come on. <laughs> So, so, so again, okay, now I'm starting to get blessed by my own talk. You know, that's all right. So anyway, so, so go get this now, go, especially those of, if you're like me, type A driven, you know, grew up without a father. And so you're, it's like you, you, you were trying to gain the appreciation of your father and sometimes without realizing. And then I came up with a, kind of a performance type Christianity, right? And didn't realize, you know, God loved me. You know, it wasn't a million sins nor a million acts of righteousness could increase or decrease his love for me, but I didn't know that. And so it was like, like I'm doing all this stuff, right? And um, and so anyway, but when it finally dawned on me, it finally hit me. And, and and to some degree, I'm still growing in that. But what I'm saying is, so 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 I found myself sometimes, you know, just being places, trying to show, trying to prove that. No, no, no. Listen, my friend. Listen. Go where your talent. Go where first of all you, your talents. And your energy. I know sometimes my energy is too much for some folks, and that's okay, my friend. I, but but listen, from now on, mark it down, Doctor Breakthrough. And I want the same for you. But mark it down, Doctor Breakthrough. I'm listen. I'm going me, my talents and my energy. I'm only going where it's going to be appreciated. Get this now. Number two, celebrated, and number three, reciprocated instead of just being tolerated. Come on now. I mean, hey, we get some of us getting too old. We can getting gray hair wisdom. Shit has some wisdom up in here. <laughs> so anyway, is that good, extra good, or super good, right? And so uh anyway, uh, but again, I, I I put up the other day, uh, this was a good one. We make profit, I make profit while fulfilling my purpose and solving other people's problems, right? So I make I, I make profit while fulfilling my purpose which is empowering people. I ignite or reignite a passion of people for life, for love, for the Lord, and for business, right? So anyway, um, so so I hope you get that. So man, 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 that's good. That's good. That's good. Okay. So, um, so again, Monday, did you get that? Mindset offsets negative. Um, uh, um, no, wait, wait, wait. That's the second one. The first one was Moving optimistically, there you go. Moving optimistically negates discouragement and yuckiness. Now we go into the second one that I like even better, and that is mindset offsets negative distractions, anticipates yeses. 
<laughs> Come on now. See, by the way, write this, ooh, write this down. Mindset is going to either hinder or, or help your skill set. Oh, let me say it again. See, mindset is going to either help or hinder your skill set. Your skill set, your ability to do things is either going to be helped or hindered by your mindset. So that's why, my friend, TGIM times seven, thank God it's a marvelous manifesting motivational, momentous mindset, money making Monday. My friend, I want to be like that cup of coffee. By the way, my phone just went up to let me know it's 813 here at Central Standard Time. Uh, Matthew 813, as thou hast believed, so be it done unto thee. Oh, come on, you couldn't have done it no better than that. See, as thou hast, uh, again, Ma Matthew, it, it, well, I don't know if you can see that, but Matthew 813, as thou hast believed, so be it done unto thee. By the way, my phone goes off throughout the day to remind me of different scriptures, and it just went off. So as thou hast believed, so be it done unto thee. And I just got done telling you, here it is, my friend, get this now. Breakthrough believers become achievers receivers and eventually succeeders. Oh, let me say it again. I said, break through believers. Some, you got to, like the man said, Lord, I believe, but help them my unbelief. So, so you got to break through the doubt. You got to break through the procrastination. You got to break, listen, break through believers. Get this now. Break through believers become achievers, receivers, and eventually succeeders. <laughs> so anyway, my friends, so on this Monday, again, mindset offsets negative distractions anticipates yeses. And you know my acronym for yes, why yes, you expect success. Yes, why yes, you embody success. Why yes, you expedite success. And so my friend, on this Monday, uh, again, this is a, uh, uh, by the way, um, it's going to make it a great day on purpose and by design. Uh, and as of today, by the way, this is my 459 million. Oh, let me check it out. Just make sure uh, I have it back in my not per close, but 459 million seven hundred and uh, see 459 million seven hundred and eighty no sixty thousand free breaths I've had so far. The average person breathes twenty thousand breaths per day. Okay, so four hundred so 459 million seven hundred forty thousand, and this is as of today is my twenty three thousand mm, <laughs> twenty three thousand and eighth day on God's wake up list. 23,000 and eighth day on God's wake up list. My incredible mom only had 18,065 days. So my friend, I'm grateful to be alive. Are you? So on this Monday, my friend, go out and make it a great day on purpose and by design. I believe in you. You can make this day great on purpose. And listen, you can bring it. Okay, I'm gonna talk about, but anyway, Ezekiel 36, 36. He says, I build the ruined places. <laughs> <laughs> I, build, I build the ruined places. So in other words, my friend, ruined people, ruined places, ruined success, whatever's ruined, God says, I build it, my friend. So you can build this week. If you can build this Monday, maybe start it off bad, you make it good, and just keep on keeping on, my friend. So when things go wrong, as they sometimes will, and the road you're trudging seems all uphill, when the funds are low and the debts are high, and you want to smile, but you have to sigh. If care is pressing you down a bit, rest if you must, but don't you quit. Life is strange with this twist and turns, as every one of us sometimes learns, and many a struggler turns about. When they might have won it, they stuck it out. Don't give up, though the pace seems slow. You may succeed with another blow. Success is failure turned inside out. The silver tint of the cloud of doubt. And you never can tell how close you are. Victory may be near, though it seems afar. So stick to the fight when your heart is hit. It's when things seem worse that you just mustn't quit. Remember that word, my friend, as thou hast believed, so be it done under thee. So how are you going to believe, my friend? I'm going to be a, I'm a break. Listen, I'm a blessed breakthrough believing believer. Thus, I'm an anointed, awesome, achieving achiever. <laughs> Awesome, awesome. Hey, okay, well, listen, my friend, God bless y'all. We'll see you now, not just at the top. We'll see you over the top because you got the power. And by the way, guess who's pulling for you? Guess who's pulling for you? The Most High. Psalm 56, 9, when I cry unto thee, then shall my enemies turn their back. This I know, for God is for me.